Today was our fourth day here in Israel, and we visited the Golan Heights. On our way, we passed by the Sea of Galilee, you can see in the background. This is the uh, Brendan Water. Okay, so we are up in the Golan Heights, close to Syria, and this is a natural spring that you can drink right from. I'm gonna get a drink with the crab. Seriously? <laughs> oh my god, he's so oh. <laughs> Mountains standing together. This is one mountain peak, another mountain peak. This is a saddle in between them, and these are the rivers that are coming up. So we have rain coming down over the top of the mountain. It's raining, 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 raining. The water simmered down through the aquifer, to the aquifer level until it reached a level of aquiclude where water cannot go anymore. And then they go inside, 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 inside. They go. They're looking for a crack. They have more and more water. They're trying to escape out because there's too much pressure. All the way until they find a crack and then it explodes. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have a spring. We're driving along the dormant volcano. Yeah. Driving up it. That would be like so. So we're really high. I'm kind of having a freak out, but I'm gonna be strong. Wow. Now we're at the top of the Golan Heights, and you can see Syria behind Matt and I. And if you look carefully, you can see the demilitarized zone. As we hiked along to the top of the mountain, there were a series of sculptures, and this is actually a little before we got to the Golan Heights. And now if you look carefully um, behind me in the next image, you'll be able to see a barbed wire fencing, and that marks the beginning of the demilitarized zone. And behind that zone is Syria, which you can see behind me in this image. Notice here the trench and the turret. This is our personal guard standing up on one of those trenches. And these are the UN peacekeepers. This is a binocular they're using to see into Syria. And this is right behind them. So tell us about this. So it looks like it's a shelter or it's a tunnel and this is where I would be if there was tremble. I'm now scouted about. Our last stop was a kibbutz, which is a community living or communal living um, residence and these are the residents there. I hope you've enjoyed this and I will see you tomorrow.